Welcome aboard a Grand Banks 36. This is the last Grand Banks 36, number 1135 of the series, built in 2001. Today we're going to do a little walkthrough video. I hope you enjoy. If you do, hit the like button and remember to subscribe to the East Coast Yacht Sales YouTube video channel. And if you wish to have more information on this or other Grand Banks built boats, please reach out to me at the email address or phone number below this video. Thanks and enjoy. Here we go. So we're going to start on the flying bridge. Two really comfortable fore and aft facing bench seats. The storage under each of them. So plenty of room for life jackets. The propane lockers actually underneath the forward one on the port side. And then of course we have full vessel controls, all new Furuno electronics, and also all new in 2019 were the BDO engine instrument gauges. Back aft there's a little extra room here. The owner's got a deck chair and table set up underneath the actual bridge deck. This slider opens up to gain access to your VHF. Here's your fusion control stereo and then tons of storage. Again, there's life jackets there. Plenty of room on the house top aft to store a dinghy. Nice wide side decks on the Grand Banks with a high bulwark and safety rails. Make it a really comfortable boat to get around even in sloppy sea conditions. Very purposeful anchor windlass, LaFrance Tigris, and two rollers. Notice that there are courtesy lights on the uh, side decks as well. And now let's have a look at the interior. Beautiful teak joiner work throughout. Corian countertops. Princess propane stove, three burner, with a convection microwave underneath. Comfortable L set tea for the salon. A table with bottle storage underneath. Nice little feature that Grand Banks has is their storage locker within the table and also cup holders. This 66 V berth has a filler, the generous hanging locker that accompanies this cabin. Cedar lined, of course. The adjoining head. This is what we commonly term a wet head with an ensuite shower. Below the berth, there's three storage doors, and you can see you've got access to your anchor locker forward. Last but not least, let's take a look at the aft cabin. This boat is special for a number of reasons, among them the Island Queen layout with drawer storage underneath, including a chart drawer. And then there's plenty of storage in these areas underneath the decks. Last but not least is an enormous hanging locker, again, cedar lined. And to accommodate the Island Queen berth, the Grand Banks 36, if you get the Island Queen, has a, an ensuite shower for the owner's stateroom as well. Please take a look at the full specs and listing and again, hit the like button and call me at the number and email address below this video if you have questions about this or other Grand Banks built boats.